Fighting over a new fire truck. It's happening in Stewart right now, where firefighters say new equipment isn't up to the dangers they face and could put public safety at risk. News Channel 5's Jason Hackett is live in Stewart to explain tonight. Jason? The city voted to buy a $200,000 truck called a mini pumper. That would replace one of the trucks that usually sits out here. Uh, that is currently out on a call right now. That isn't sitting very well with many members of the firefighters union here in Stewart. Now, here is what the truck looks like. It's called, as I said, a mini pumper. It holds 400 gallons of water and pumps 1,500 gallons per minute. Now, Chief David Dial says a big reason for replacing the larger engine with this one is because in the long run, it's cheaper to maintain. He also says the truck is capable of responding to a fire if need be. However, the Stewart chapter of the International Association of Firefighters disagrees. They say the engine they're using now is good enough, and this new engine doesn't live up to the standards necessary to save lives. This is not just uh, a waste of taxpayer money, <coughs> which it is, but this is also going to put our lives as the firefighters in danger. That's definitive. The citizens are going to be put in danger, not just inside the city, but inside the county. Now, new tonight at 6, you'll hear from the chief as he addresses the concerns of those firefighters directly. We're live in Stewart tonight. Jason Hackett, WPTV News Channel 5.